Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Elkrips and today we're going to be reacting to More Star vs. The Forces of Evil Season 3. And these episodes are titled Club Snap and Stranger Danger. So, the last two episodes, Scent of a Hoodie and Rust in Putin. A lot happened. First of all, in Scent of a Hoodie, Ponyhead and Star were basically battling, I guess, a laundry night in order to save Marco's hoodie stench. In the end, Star ended up returning the hoodie to Marco, and there was a bit of shipping fuel in that episode. Yep. I can definitely see some hardcore shipping happening this season, but who knows, who knows. And in the episode, Rust and Puddin, wow, Rockmith might not return. He's staying dead for at least this season. So, I'm not really sure, that kind of came of a shock. I didn't really expect Lockmith to be dead. I mean, I wanted to see him return, but I guess that's not happening anytime soon. And Glossoric, he returned. Yeah, um, that happened. I don't know what he's going to be doing in this episode, but, you know, we're just going to have to wait and see. So, this episode, Club Snob and Stranger Danger. Thumbnail. Off the bat, this is kind of spoilers. Eclipsa is going to come back in this episode. Yeah, the thumbnail shows Eclipsa and Star sitting together. I know in the Battle for Muni, the last episode, Toffee, they showed a hint that she was going to break free. And in the promos of the, I believe it was the live um, Star and Marco chat, that she would actually end up making a return and Star might actually make a deal with her. Yeah, that's... Oh boy. Yeah. Mmm, what could happen? Oh man, this episode, I'm not prepared for, but we're gonna just dive right into it. So, I believe that's all I have to say as far as predictions go. So, without further ado, let's get on with the reaction. I love intros and themes. Uh, oh, um, yeah, no. Someone's in a uh, teenage mood. Whoa, those legs, though. <laughs> Tom. Confused. <laughs> People were confused if this was a flashback or present. I'm starting to think it's present. Yeah. Oh. Tom. Yep. Hey. Those are his parents. Oh. Yikes. Wow. I love Interesting. I <laughs> hmm. Oh. What is up with Tom? Seriously. I thought they were, um, okay. What? Oh, I don't know. 
Uh, <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, what? That's a bit much. Not star. It's not gonna be star. Not this year. Uh, did you have to mention that? Nope, not. Oh. Drama! You look lovely today. What? No, you do. Someone's gonna get jealous. Oh man. He's playing that game. Yeah. We've known that in the past, but. Okay then! Sure! Mm. Ooh. Uh. Oh. Um. This is awkward. <laughs> um. Let's make it more awkward. Sure. Why not? Except for. They're saving the best for last. <laughs> hmm. It's getting intense. The tension. Neither one of them are those things. Oh, poor Tom. Star, I was there on Sunday. I, I know. You're with Marco now. Oh, Oh! a huge wake-up call. I finally realized you're not into me. So, wow. Oh, man. Tom Coe's shippers went down. I was just trying to do the right thing. Yeah, he was. But at the same time... Oh. Oh man. Oh. Oh no, the parents. <laughs> I love this. Oh my. Oh my. Yeah, this is getting a bit. Uh, okay. All right then. Oh. Oh. Yeah. It starts off with tension and then it gets actually lighthearted. They're actually, oh, they're both really good dancers. I saw this in the promo, so I know what happens, but I don't know what happens after the dance. That's so pretty. Oh, man. Wow. They're really good dancers. <laughs> That's adorable. Uh, um, yeah. 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 Oh, that's funny. Wow, that's deadly tears. Oh, <laughs> uh, wow, okay. <laughs> oh, 
a good episode. I like that. Oh. Glossic? I'm confused. <laughs> okay, um, this is weird. He's acting like a dog. Oh, oh, no, no, Glossic, no. A unicorn squirrel. Oh. Oh my. Oh jeez, there goes Glossic. So he's a... so quickly. Hmm. Oh man. Does Moon know? And how did she- I have so many questions right now. What? Here we go! Here we are. What? 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 What's going on? I'm so confused. Yeah. I'm I'm evil. No, you don't. I just I am evil. Ha ha ha. Okay, I. It is rigged. I was reading the book. She didn't know. Are you evil? Uh, no. Are you evil? Are you evil? Are you evil? She's not. I want to know what the heck is going on. Right away. Glasser, what is going on with you? Oh my. <laughs> oh, Glasser. Wand. I can just see him being a meme right now. Oh. There we go. No! No! Oh! I have a feeling... I just don't know! I don't know what to think of her. Oh! Oh my! Oh! Issue. about her. When I watched um, Battle Moon a few times, she seemed not as innocent as I thought. Uh, 
Uh, okay, yeah, not very funny. Oh, look, it's Glossark. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with him. Mmm, I... Mmm, is it... I don't know how I feel about this. I just don't. I'm so... off with that. I... <sighs> Club Hangers, really? <sighs> yes, she is. I'm sorry. I'm just... Any questions right now? <sighs> I don't know what to say, but I have so many questions and it's all on my mind, and I just. Guys, Eclipse is here. She got off her crystal, but we didn't see that part. The Magic High Commission got all suited up, and somehow they found out. Right when she broke free and couldn't find her, and yet she was in her garden. There's so many questions. And she loved roses. Yeah, I can see the symbolism right there. I guess looks can be deceiving. I just don't know if I really trust her or not. She technically... I think she's going to be the main villain of season 3. I'm just going to say that right now. I think she's going to be the main villain of season 3. That episode, like, bam, right in the beginning, it's just like, oh, hey, Eclipsa, I'm here. And what the heck is happening with Glasswick? It's like he was aged back in time, or he lost all of his wise knowledge. Now he just says Globgore or whatever. Globgore, Glasswick, Globgore, I don't know. But, yeah, hopefully, and what Eclipsa did to the thing on his head. I'm worried that she's doing something. Ugh. I mean, she was kidding around saying I'm corrupting him. But is her being free? Maybe having something to do with Glossark acting this way? I know I do like Eclipsa, but I am on the fence. I don't know if I really trust her. She's very relatable. But I don't know if I truly trust her yet. I'm hoping that the next episode will explain to us how she exactly got free. Her crystal was breaking by the end of Battle for Muni. But I want to know how she really escaped the um, crystal temple. And how the Magic High Commission found out right away. And how Moon found out right away. And how everyone got dressed and ready for action. That type of thing. So I want to see how this all happened. Because we did not see that in this episode, but chances are, future episodes, we're gonna see that. We should, because that would be kind of weird if we didn't. But overall, pretty great episodes. So, I thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a comment down below, tell me what you thought of this episode. Wow, um, Eclipsa, she's broken free. Star and her, yeah, definitely gonna be more of a team. And I think Star is going to get pretty close to Eclipsa. And I don't know if Eclipsa is going to manipulate Star. And I don't know what the deal is with her monster um, husband or lover. I don't know if he's still alive. I don't know if he's going to make an appearance. I hope we get some flashbacks though of Eclipsa's past and how she ruled Muni. And because I definitely want to see this. Because if everything Moon says is true, or is it? Or was it just recorded that way? Like, no one really knows how she ruled Muni. But she ran away to be with someone she loves. 
but she broke order. Like, there's so many back and forths. Like, she doesn't seem evil, but everyone's saying she's evil. So, is she? Hmm. Where the facts add up? Who knows? I guess we're just gonna have to wait and see in future episodes, and hopefully we get an explanation. Hopefully, we get an explanation in the future. Hopefully soon. Please. Because I wanna know how the heck she got free so fast, and how this all took place. So, I thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time, bye guys!